twice in the last four days. Drones have crashed into sporting events. A drone comes out of nowhere. Mechanical failure happens, you never know. Things fail, drones fall out of the sky. And on the bad side, you had videos of people in Mosul using drones with bombs on them. They're really dangerous systems. And for very little amount of money, um, they become a, a poor man's cruise missile. The question is, how do you stop this thing? We build systems that can detect, deter, and defeat drones. That can actually, with deep learning and machine vision, see a drone in sky and be able to chase it down and be able to actually take it out of the sky. We actually physically intercept the drone. Um, we don't rely on electronic jamming. This drone is designed to chase down yeah, other drones. You've got a whole vision system at the front, a camera system that feeds into the deep learning and all the compute power we have underneath, and it has a lot of tow capacity. It can deploy a parachute. And there's three things this drone has to do, right? Number one is it has to detect. It has to be able to see in this cluttered world of wires and trees, that's a drone and that's a bird. It needs to be able to detect and classify the target. The second part of it is, sometimes you don't want to take out the other drone. You just want to warn them. And so it has to be able to you know, deter that target, get in front of it, block its access, um, let it know it's there. And then the third option is you may want to actually defeat that target. We use Kevlar, which gets, which gets right into the props, and, but you're holding the target. Just in case that drone has something really dangerous on it, you can do forensics on that drone, fingerprints on the drone, um, maybe opening up without damaging or setting off whatever's in there. One of the most valuable things that we have built in this company is actually our guidance platform. It's our detection platform that at very high frame rates can see targets in space and be able to go to them. This is our command center. Think of it like an aircraft carrier for the drone. This command center has everything. It's got power, it's got a full command center with radar in it. You'll also see camera systems. These are all systems that help us see uh, drones and detect them from far away. And so over here, you look inside on the displays, on the far right-hand side, you've got a radar system. You've got tracking on both your drone and the target drone. You actually can see what the, what the actual drone is seeing in the compute cloud. And then at some point in time, this stuff's all gonna miniaturize and get smaller and smaller. And eventually an officer's gonna be able to open something out of the back of his trunk and be able to press a button and boom, it'll take a drone out of the sky.